Never before has any film contained such a full measure of the joy of living, the drama of living, and above all, the glorious romance that makes this such a wonderful life. Welcome to The Story Beyond the Story, an historical fiction anthology podcast series, and to our first podcast, Wonderful. Did you ever wonder where writers get their ideas? For screenwriters Frances Goodrich and her husband, Albert Hackett, the writers of It's a Wonderful Life, Much of it was drawn from their life in Hollywood. Oh, and a little secret, working on Frank Capra's It's a Wonderful Life was anything but wonderful. I can't believe you're trying to sabotage this movie. Oh, this thing is never going to get made and you know it. The script's not working, Jimmy's out, Capra's nuts. Face it, it's over. You promised me four weeks of working together. This is not working together. Okay, fine. Let's do the next scene. Fine. Skip ahead page 20. The dinner scene that we still haven't written. Oh, God. I couldn't face being cooped up for the rest of my life in this shitty little office working on this crap. Albert, that's good. That's it. What? What's good about... Say say that again, what you just said, but like it's George talking to his father. Oh, like... Oh, now, Pop, I I couldn't face being cooped up for the rest of my life in this shitty little office. It may be shabby office. Okay, then he stops, right? He realizes that he's hurt his father. Right, right. He feels bad. He says something like... Oh, now, Pop, I... I couldn't. I uh, I couldn't face being cooped up for the rest of my life in a shabby little office. No, oh, I'm, I'm sorry, Pop. I didn't mean that. I, but I, it, it's this business of nickels and dimes and spending all your life trying to figure out how to save three cents and length of pipe. I go crazy. I, I want to do something big and something important. Listen to episodes of Wonderful on Apple Podcasts or wherever you get your podcasts.